After two seasons at Xavier, senior defender Jansen Miller decided it was time for change. The Baldwin, Missouri native took his talents to Indiana where he has started his last four matches after waiting for his chance to shine. It, it was exciting, but I just knew I needed to take this opportunity because, um, I mean, at a program like this, anybody can play. Like, we have people on the bench who could easily be playing for us, like, be playing right now and just... I need to play well or I'll be right right back on the bench. Miller has embraced the challenge of coming into a program like IU and faced struggles when trying to find club teams to play for when he was younger. Thanks to the support from his family, he found the right team for his skill. It was super expensive, so my parents were like, oh, we'll just keep him on these like lower level teams. And my grandma was like, no, no, let's, let's, let's get him on that team. So she actually paid for my first couple of years of club when I was like seven, eight years old. His talent on the pitch helped him play up a couple of years with the U-16s when he was just 14 years old. Miller would play club with former Hoosier center back Daniel Muni and even Joey Mayer. Just getting to grow up with him, um, and he's the same person that he was <laughs> back then. He's always been very mature, um, gone about his business, very professional-like. And we've been very close. I mean, we played right next to each other for three years, and he, uh, he helped me, I helped him. The Hoosier ties go even further as Miller played with Carson Henderlong at Xavier and even played against him in club. He was one of my best friends at Xavier now just coming here. We've become so much closer. We hang out like every single day. When I got to Xavier like an older brother, we, would, we played against each other growing up in academy and we actually hated each other. He, uh, he scored a hat-trick on me and Joey in academy. We had Joey playing center back and he scored three goals on us so he always gives us trouble about that. It was the connections he made along the way that brought him to Bloomington from the portal. So I would say what drew me here was the people that I was just close with, comfortable with, and I, and I trusted the people here. And then obviously the, the stats and everything speaks for itself. That's what drew me here. I mean, if you do well here, you, can, you have a lot of opportunities. Everything has come full circle for Miller, and he appreciates how hard head coach Todd Yeagley has been on him. He's, he's not a coach who will, who will lie to you. Um, he'll tell you how it is. And, when, I mean, he told me how it was, and I, I feel like I've kind of earned his almost, not respect, but I've, I've earned the right to play. In his first game as a Hoosier, Miller saw his opportunity and took it as he buried home a header off a corner kick against Butler. First time playing last year for IU, and then I think like 20 minutes in, I scored, um, and then went scores in the, in the game. That was probably best individual moment in college. As time dwindles down as a Hoosier, Miller finds this program very special. And with an extra year of eligibility, who knows what is yet to come. I would just say discipline, and then there's, like, it's very structured um, year in and year out. I mean, I've only been here for two years, but just hearing from Joey, like, it's the same every year. I mean.